Hi all, this is a Microsoft Scalp Ergonomic uh, mouse and the problem is that the left button is not doing any click and it's not working properly and I like this mouse and it's pretty expensive so I thought to try to order the push button on the mouse Ah, here I hear a click. I hope you can hear it. This one have a click, but this one doesn't. So let's try to replace and see first how to do it. So using hot air, I think, I'm not sure it will be good because I can ruin the plastic here. So what I thought to do is using two soldering irons to replace this one. So instead of talking, let's try to put some light and try to, to see if this can be done. So again, the left one, this one. So I will try using technique of two soldering irons, but first I need to see that the two of them are working. Yeah, I don't know why it stopped. So the procedure to do it, I think first is to add some more solder paste because when you are doing so, it will be easier, I think, to replace it. So I'm applying solder to all pins. And now I will try to use the two soldering iron at the same time. Yeah, ha, very easy, you see. Okay, so this is, of course, a many years of experience with electronics and doing such a thing so again the click here anyway it doesn't work very well and now let's see how complicated it is to put the new one so basically the technique should be the same i mean using two irons two soldering iron at the same time so let's first, the most important thing is of course to put it in its correct place. And now it's a little shifted, so I will try to put it like this. And now basically I need to do exactly the same process. Hit on both sides on the same time, but it, now it is movable, so you need to do it pretty quick. This is first side. And then when you're going from one point to the other, need to shift it a little like this it's a little tricky and now uh, what I w want to make sure that it's in its place yeah it looks okay now I will show the process of putting everything back should be pretty easy but Again, I could take this out without opening uh, the side of the mouse. So what you need to do is bend it and then I think it will be able to get to its place. You to remember, yeah, it was something like this. Yeah, and we have 
uh, here the spring that I hope it will not fall but first I want to make sure that everything is in its correct place yeah and now I have this uh, three Phillips screws that maybe I can now connect yeah I think everything is in, in place now Last screw. Let's screw it to its place. Now the trick here, I see there is some dirt on the button. Okay, here what you need to do is just push it gently to its place. There are the spring, so you need first to, to adjust to the spring position and then just push it and you have this pin here, so you see the clicks are okay also the left button, which did not work and now what we need to do is first connect this one something like this and we have many many screws that are Allen screws I don't know the size anyway I could find something that fit so we need to of course put the five screw back This is tricky. But at the end, everything is get to its correct place. Additional two. So one I see here. And the last one, the last one, where is the last one? One, two, three, four, and where is the fifth? Ah, here, here, here. It's on the square, square hole. Again, the tricky part is to get it to its place. Now I think no, it did not fall to its place yet. No, are you playing a game with me? One screw is doing doing some issues, 
but I think it's I think it's okay. It did catch in the correct place and it is screw and everything is okay. So the last part is just doing something like this. Pushing everything back. Yeah, but it is not in the correct place. So let's understand why it is doing this to me. It's not fair. Aha! You see? Now I have both click. Both looks okay. So last step is to see that this is working and here you will have to believe me that I'm not bluffing you. So let's see. So let's see. Yeah. I swear that it's work perfectly okay now. So I did. I was able to fix it. Okay. You see? You don't see. But believe me that now the button is working perfectly. You can hear the click that was not before and it was not working. So basically this is all. Thank you and bye.